Listen and practice speaking skills. Chris, isn't it such a beautiful day? I'm glad we decided to explore the city together. Absolutely, Sophie. It's perfect weather for a stroll. I always love discovering new spots in the city. Me too. Speaking of which, have you tried that new cafe that just opened on Main Street? Not yet, but I've heard great things about it. Shall we check it out? Definitely. I could use a pick-me-up. Plus, they supposedly have the best avocado toast in town. Avocado toast it is, then. Lead the way, Sophie. After you, Chris. So, how's work been treating you lately, Sophie? It's been busy, but I can't complain. I'm actually working on a new project that's really exciting. That sounds intriguing. What's it about? It's a marketing campaign for a sustainable clothing brand. We're aiming to raise awareness about eco-friendly fashion choices. Wow, that's awesome. I love when companies prioritize sustainability. Can't wait to see the campaign. Thanks, Chris. Hey, have you made any plans for the weekend? Not yet, but I'm thinking of going for a hike in the mountains. The weather's supposed to be perfect for it. That sounds like a great idea. Mind if I tag along? Of course not. The more, the merrier. It'll be a fun day out in nature. Agreed. I've been craving some fresh air and scenic views lately. Hey, speaking of cravings, do you want to grab some ice cream after we check out the cafe? Absolutely. Ice cream sounds like the perfect treat on a warm day like today. I couldn't agree more. So, have you been reading anything interesting lately, Sophie? Actually, yes. I just finished a mystery novel that kept me on the edge of my seat the whole time. Nice. I love a good mystery. What's the title? It's called The Girl on the Train. Highly recommend it if you're into suspenseful reads. I'll add it to my reading list. Thanks for the recommendation, Sophie. Anytime, Chris. Hey, do you want to stop by that bookstore over there? I heard they have a great selection of books. Sure thing. I'm always up for browsing new books. Great, let's go. Hey there, Emily. How's your day going? Hi, John. It's been pretty good, just busy with work. How about you? Oh, not too bad. 
Just the usual grind, you know. Yeah, I hear you. So, any plans for the weekend? Actually, I was thinking of going for a hike. The weather's supposed to be nice. That sounds amazing. I might join you if I can manage to squeeze it in. That'd be great. It's always more fun with company. Plus, we could use the exercise. Definitely. Sitting in front of a computer all week isn't exactly the best for staying in shape. Tell me about it. But speaking of computers, have you heard about the new software update at work? Yeah, I saw the email about it. Do you think it'll make things easier? Or just more complicated? Hard to say, but I guess we'll find out soon enough. Change is inevitable, right? True. Anyway, have you been watching any good shows lately? Actually, I just started this new series on Netflix. It's about a group of friends solving mysteries in their small town. Oh, that sounds intriguing. What's it called? It's called The Mystery Squad. It's kind of cheesy, but in a fun way. I'll have to check it out. I've been looking for something new to binge watch. Definitely give it a shot. So, have you made any progress on that project we were discussing? A little bit. I've been brainstorming some ideas, but nothing concrete yet. Well, if you need any help or want to bounce ideas off someone, you know where to find me. Thanks, John. I might take you up on that offer. Sometimes it's helpful to get a fresh perspective. Absolutely. Two heads are better than one, as they say. Couldn't agree more. Hey, do you have any plans for lunch? I was thinking of trying out that new cafe down the street. Actually, I was just about to suggest the same thing. What a coincidence. Great minds think alike, right? Shall we? Let's do it. I could use a good cup of coffee to get me through the rest of the day. Sounds like a plan. Lead the way, my friend. <laughs>